All right, the Cam Pro i826 body cam. What comes in the box? Structure manual, software disc, the camera itself. There's a USB, the mini USB cable, not a type C or anything, unfortunately. There's a power adapter to plug into the wall. This is a docking station to um, charge the camera. And this is a uh, clip. It rotates 360 degrees. Use with the camera. With the software disc, I haven't tried it. Um, I've used the camera for a couple of days now. It seems to be fine. If anything, I'll just download the uh, software from the website if I need to upgrade, update the firmware or anything like that. So that's it. Anyway, this camera, comparing it to the MuFly EH15, they appear to be rebranded versions of the same camera. They're identical, in, nearly identical in size. The controls are all the same. very similar except the fact that, that the cam pro has an AV port and an HDMI port and uh, the USB ports are in the same spot so this is US the MuFly is USB type C and the cam pro is mini USB they look the same the indicators on top the power button and the um, flashlight slash uh, infrared button are on the top Oh yeah, and this MiUfly mount slides in from the side and the cam pro slides in from the top so this is a 64, the Cam Pro 64 gigabyte version, and the Mio Fly is 128. Both good cameras, except in this particular version, mine, the one I had, it's got a bit of an audio issue, and um, it's got this rattling noise. I don't know if the camera could pick it up, so I've got to return it. Now getting back to the Cam Pro, it works the same way as the Mio Fly. Power button is on top, so you start it up. Makes nice whole noise and starts up. The menu button, you get all the different settings that you can access. You get, you know, when you get out of the menu, you hit the top. You hit the uh, power button once. When it's on, it just returns back to standby mode. At the top of it, power button, long press to turn on and off. This one, short press to turn on and off the infrared. You can see the lights a little better here. Short press to turn on and off the infrared. And long press to turn on and off the flashlight. Headphones, headphones slash AV, um, audio video, you HDMI, you could plug it in, you could plug it into a monitor, you got the uh, USB, mini, mini USB, start button is to mark recordings, audio record stop start, uh, picture taking, uh, video record stop start, this is the 64 GB version, also comes in 128, a quick record feature so off, it's completely off, and you hit the... I mean, it does, it does the same with the, re the audio record button, but if you hit the video record button, and you hold it down for a few seconds, three seconds or something like that, it automatically starts recording. Yeah, like that. And to shut it off, you could either hit that, or you can long press the power button. It automatically turns off. You plug it into the docking station. All right, so there you go. And I think both of them turn, I think, I'm not sure, but I think both of them turn green when it's fully charged. And uh, it's green to indicate it's on, and red to indicate that it's charging. It's in, when it's in standby mode, that one's green, and when it stops recording, it turns red. There's no indicators in front or anything, all the indicators are on top. And to play back the videos, you hit this button right over here. And play button you could pause and rewind and all that kind of stuff rewind with this button and fast forward with this button and resume playback with this button so there it is all right let's get into some video footage
Thank you very much. Right, have a good night. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.